Hello, snowboarders of the internet. I'm your host, Avrin Lefebvre, and this is Boot Fitting 101. This is the second part of a two-part video in our series of boot fitting on how to beat bunions, rooster spurs, and sixth toe. If you haven't watched part one of this two-part episode, you need to go back and watch it. Taking off from where we left off, we know that we've pushed out the area where the bunion is on the toe and the heel spur on the back. But let's say that they're not giving you enough room and you're still getting hot spots. What is someone to do? Well, you're gonna get wily. That's what you're gonna do. To do this quick tip, you're gonna need a razor knife and possibly a heat gun. Not everyone's gonna need the heat gun, but it will make heating up the outside of that liner easier to cut into. That's right, we're cutting the liner. The first thing you want to do after you've already gone through part one of this video series and pushed out that bunion or that rooster spur is mark on the liner where it's bumping out and where those hot spots are. You can do that with a Sharpie, it doesn't even matter what color as long as you get a line on there. You want to make it in the shape of an X though. Once you've marked that spot, you want to cut into the liner and you're going to put a fair amount of pressure into it, but you want to make sure that you do not slice all the way through. So if you need to take a couple swipes with the razor, go for it. It's far easier than putting a ton of pressure and then blowing through the inside of the liner. Once you've cut everything, you want to stick your hand down in there and push on the area and see if it's going to pop out. If it does pop out, good. If it doesn't, you may need to cut it more. You're going to repeat this same step back on the heel where that rooster spur is, that bone spur, that annoying little spot in the back, and do the same thing. The heels generally tend to be a little bit thicker foam, so be prepared to put a little more pressure on it than you would have on the toe bunion. Now, for those of you with six toe, this is actually a really easy fix. So you've heat molded it, it's not working. Well, what's next? Slit the liner. You wanna mark it with a straight line right over the affected area, and then you're just gonna cut that line with the razor knife. Pinch the sides, maybe put your hand inside and push it out a little bit, and just see if you can get it to move. Now, if one slit is not enough, you can cut another line underneath it, if need be, to just get it to push up. I didn't do it in this video, but I know you people are handy enough to understand what I'm saying. If you're not, well then you need to go see a boot fitter. After you've done all this work, whether you've cut the heel spur, the frickin' bunion, or the six toe, try it on, see if it fits, see if you're noticing any hot spots still. If you are, you may have to go in, hit those areas with the heat gun, and pull some of the foam out of those X's or from amongst the slit on the six toe. I'm not saying all of you will have that, I'm just saying some of you might. Sometimes I have to go back in. And just so you know, needle nose pliers are your friend in this situation. They're actually a really viable tool for just getting in there and pulling out some excess foam if you need to. This is a little bit more of an advanced boot fit technique, so if you don't feel comfortable with it, don't do it or email me. I'm here to help you guys and talk you through it. So hopefully you guys have learned a little something from this two-part section of the video series. If you have, leave me a comment down below. Let me know that you're gonna try this, not try this. Either way, I just wanna know what you're working on and hopefully this will alleviate some of your guys' problems that have bunions or rooster spurs or even six toe. And as always, I'm sure some fucking stupid troll is going to leave me a comment as well. I don't give a shit, you're a troll. If you're new here, remember to subscribe, click the bell, get those notifications. You want to make sure you set it for all notifications. That way you won't miss any of the content we're working on for you guys out there. And if you really want to support us, check out Angry Snowboarder VIP. The Boot Fitting 101 series was brought to you 100% by our community over on Angry Snowboarder VIP. We couldn't have made this happen without them. They wanted it, and all the snowboarders of the internet have been able to benefit from it. As always, I've been your host, Avery Lefebvre, and I'll see you in another video.